Hello, welcome back. Um, hopefully a short video today. Um, so since being a blood biker, I have had more instances where I've needed to beat my horn at, quite frankly, idiots on the road. And the horn on the BMW R1300GS, like most other bikes, isn't exactly brilliant. So uh, recently I ordered this. Uh, from Nippy Norman, the Soundbomb Mini from Denali. Um, really struggling to say that word, but anyway. So it says on the Nippy Norman, the, the Nippy Norman website that it takes less than five minutes to fit. Now I'm famously amongst my friends known for not exactly being the most mechanically minded. Um, and I can round off bolt heads uh, like a pro. So let's see if that's actually true and if I can make this work. Let's quickly have a look at what you get in the in the box and uh, at the end we'll do a sound comparison uh, from the original over to this so if, if that sounds interesting stay tuned <laughs> Okay, so in the box, not really a lot in there. We have the actual sound bomb itself uh, with the mounting bracket there. Stick that there. The actual sound bomb itself with an extra bolt, the instructions and a wiring harness to convert it from uh, these two over to the BMW. Now what this hasn't got on it that the instructions mention is obviously meant is it of it obviously mentions that you know you know one of these posts uh is is the positive and the other is the negative however there is nothing on these wires that i can see so hopefully i should get it right um if not i hopefully it will just be a case of swapping it around uh and it will work so let's get to fitting it and see if it takes less than five minutes even for a cretin like me. Okay, so I don't know how easy this is going to be. This is going to be to see, but by the looks of it, all we need is a 10 mil spanner, a 13 mil, and to remove the plug. So let's see. Under five minutes. Let's get that wiring harness off. That was quite easy. And uh, let's get the bolt that's on the back of the original horn. See if I can reach that. Okay, that was quite quite loose. Undo that. Okay, it's a very shallow nut with a washer on there. There we go. Right, so that's the old horn off. Keep hold of those. And now let's get the sound bomb. I've already put the wires onto the terminal and I've already put this little 10 mil nut on uh, and tighten that up. So from what I from what I can gather, this needs to be mounted here. So it hangs down. Now I'm not sure if that's going to be a bit low. So I might move that around a little bit just to get a better spot on it. Right, okay, I think that, that should be all right. So let's reuse the original, the original nut. Ah, okay, there isn't a bolt. Okay, so a uh, little bit of an issue. In the instructions, it says to reuse the original bolt to mount onto the bike. However, the original horn has the bolt built in and it is not removable and they do not provide you with one in the kit. So I've had to source uh, a 13 mil bolt. It's a bit too long, but I'll worry about that lay later on. So let's get that fitted and I can try to find a shorter bolt at a later date. So I had to get, I had to get, an Allen socket to do this up as it's not the original bolt. That's nice and tight. So 
just the wiring now to worry about. Let's find the original BMW you want. There we go, that's clicked in place. I'm gonna put, put a cable cable tie around that to hold it in or catch on in on anything. I'm sure people are probably watching this thinking, what an absolute hash of an installation, but I may change the angle of it at a later date. That's all fitted and installed. I'm gonna do some checks off camera just to make sure that it doesn't snag anything and then we'll see how it sounds okay so this is the standard horn maybe doing this in my shed isn't the best idea i i've ever had but there you go let's see what it sounds like i'm not sure that's any louder really if i'm brutally honest so yeah that's the install of the really struggle with words that start with did it with d the denali sound bomb um might not come out very well on camera um i wouldn't say it's any louder than the oem horn the oem horn is a bit screechy and ear sort of ear piercing uh this is more deeper and and a more rich sort of you know sound so yeah incredibly happy i have fed back to nippy normans um that to install this on the R1300 uh, GS, you do need uh, a short, you know, 13 mil bolt, which isn't the end. The end isn't the end. The end of of the world. I do think it should be included in the kit if it's uh if it's meant to be everything you need. However, not the end of the world. Anyway, um, just like to say a big thank you for everyone who's subscribed recently. Uh, absolutely blown away by it. Uh, so if you do like this sort of thing and you listen to me droning on then please consider hitting that like and subscribe button and i'll have the chiggy video uh ready hopefully by the end of this week thanks for watching